synopsis on award for science fiction literature and it's the UK's premier prize for the genre. Um, so we have been running for 27 years. The easiest way to describe that is actually the thing I don't do, which is choose the winning books. Um, pretty much anything else, that's me. PR, marketing, working with publishers, um, getting the word out there. And what release are you most excited for at the moment? This year, I mean, um, one of the main things for us is actually um, something that's going on right now. If people are looking out on the, um, the tubes, they'll see posters for a book called The Shining Girls by an author called Lauren Bucus. Now, uh, Shining Girls is her third novel, and it was her second novel, Zoo City, which won the Arthur C. Clarke Award two years ago. She's a fantastic writer, but now she's a fantastically well-known international writer um, with one of the hot summer bestseller novels. Um, so we were very pleased to get there first. She's ours. I'm a good writer. I'm a good copywriter. Um, I don't think I'm a novelist. I have absolute respect for the people who put all of that, uh, you know, can put together 80,000 words, 120,000 words. That's the sort of typical length of a novel these days, the shorter ones. George R. R. Martin's even longer. Um, so the ability to actually take and tell a story in prose, I'd love to be able to do that. If we came to your house for dinner, what would you think of? Is this a sci-fi question? Should I be saying food pills? Should I be sort of saying, you know, kind of stuff in a packet you'd eat on the, it's on the lunar module or something like that? Because um, to be honest, it would probably be some kind of Italian-based tomato uh, pasta sauce. Which the following apply to you? A safe driver? I don't drive anymore. We're in a cab. <laughs> Lover of bars? Nope. Afraid of donkeys? <laughs> I've never yet met a donkey I couldn't master. If you could pick any job to do right now, what would um, I love running the Clark Award. It's my seventh year doing it. I said I'd do it for five. That should probably tell you something. If I could figure out a way to get paid for doing it, that would be even better. What music are you listening to at the moment? David Bowie. Uh, the classics, the new album especially. I'm loving that. Um, this is all coming coming around going to the V&A, another favourite building of mine. I've seen that Bowie exhibition twice. I'm going again in a couple of weeks' time. Um, I think I'm a fan. PC or Mac? So, what's a PC? <laughs> theatre or film? Coming back to theatre, actually, I studied theatre at university, but I then had a phase of actually being put off of it because I'd studied it and started analysing it so much, but I've really started getting back into it as much more of an audience member recently. Who would play you in your biopic? <laughs> I have no idea. Um, no, I don't know that one at all. But I'll